Good afternoon and welcome. This is the final presentation of the Data Science for Social Good program 2019. It's great to see so many of you here coming from a broad range of backgrounds, academia, industry, and the third sector. When, when I first saw this program at Chicago, what stuck with me was how well thought through the program is and it needed to be brought to the UK. The UK has a, has a strong NGO sector as well as close links between science and government. Who better to champion this than our National Institute for Data Science and AI, the Alan Turing Institute. Together with its founding member, the University of Warwick, who has its motto, excellence with purpose. So for those who don't know me, I'm Sebastian Wormer. I'm an associate professor for mathematics and statistics at the University of Warwick, as well as program director for data study groups at the Alan Turing Institute, as well as the co-director for the health, pro health program. I was convinced after this, but I have had to convince others. <laughs> and um, what had, luckily, what helped was that the goals that the Turing Institute has are very much aligned with the core values of this program. Training the next generation of data science leaders and applying research to the real world are the core of this program. In fact, combining training and delivery in a way that is better, better than doing them separately is really what uh, makes this so, so great. The solutions that come out of this, this uh, program are innovative and using state-of-the-art methodology. Moreover, they help the third sector to make more data-driven decision-making and thus, uh, of course, foster an earning of innovation within government and the third sector. This is us on the first day. It is a cohort of, nine, uh, of 19 people with diverse backgrounds, gender balance, from the 20s to the, uh, to the 40s, um, um, from undergraduate to PhD student and beyond, different disciplines, uh, they're different, uh, they came to us with different learning goals, but were united in the, in, the, in the ambition to spend their summer tackling problems that matter with like-minded people. In the summer, the 12 weeks, they received a broad data science training. It takes a strong academic base and moves it to being able to deliver data products. Um, this is done by uh, using support of project managers as well as technical, uh, technical mentors. And it's complemented by ethics discussion and a Friday talk series which we shared with our sister site at the Imperial College London. Mo moreover, the pro product uh, delivery was done in close collaboration with the project partners who are, who are here in the room today. And um, there's a continuous, this will be a continuous benefit when these uh, products are deployed. But a lot of things happened behind the scenes. So what have, you have, what have you missed? So there are five projects here today, but we had more than 46 candidates. Similarly, the, here the cohort of 19 was selected among, among 800 applicants. Setting a pilot up on this scale is not easy. And I'm uh, very grateful th for the su support of the University of Warwick, and particularly the Mathematics and Computer Science Department, as well as, well as the B uh, Warwick Business School, who is kindly hosting us tonight. Also, the Alan Turing Institute, in particular, the AI, AI program, which focuses on safe and ethical AI, ha has been very supportive, um, as well as our sponsors. We are very grateful for Accenture for uh, uh, um, generous sponsoring and training around bad actors. We are grateful uh, to Microsoft for providing cloud credits um, without which all this computation couldn't have happened. And also the uh, um, ONS Data Science Campus who have pr provided valuable technical input into this project and are a, a close partner. So with this help, we were, uh, were able to do to do to do uh, to do this uh, this pilot, and uh, when you listen to the talks by our fellows, you will see that it actually was a big success. So, what's the take-home message? Let's uh, think about our namesake, Alan Turing. He was at once theoretical as well as practical. This is not about publishing papers, 
It's about making things happen and not just telling, I told you so. Um, Alan Turing um, faced, the, the, faced the societal issues of his time. It included the war and gruesome, homophobic, discriminatory laws that affected him. He didn't just publish a, a paper. We can, at some point, crack the enigma when we have the next Apple uh, computer coming in 50 years' time. No, he did a vital contribution as part of a team to actually crack the enigma. And this is um, where we do um, our, our, our step. We have to have our, the obligation to, do, uh, to not just publish, to deliver data products that are make a measurable impact. And, and what's really helpful is the data scientists we've trained for this. They are well-rounded, they are collaborative, they are problem-focused, problem and they are extremely driven. And that you will see in the, in the talks to come. Um, I would I'll give a, sp a special thanks to the uh, DSSG Foundation, to Paul, who is in the room today, as well as um, a, a, a late, who are part of the, uh, of the Data Science for Social Good Foundation. And m special and incredible thanks goes to Rai Ghani, who came up with this program at the University of Chicago and who has been a great mentor to me. Thank you.